Meow, meow. It's April 28th, and today in Philippine history, Ponciano Bernardo died in 1949 in Nueva Ecija. Ponciano Bernardo was born in Santa Rosa, Nueva Ecija, but he was originally from Pandi, Bulacan. He graduated from the University of the Philippines with a degree in civil engineering in 1927. In 1946, he was appointed mayor of Quezon City by President Sergio Osmeña. During his tenure, Quezon City was the capital of the Philippines. Under his term, the young city needed a civil engineer at the helm to help plan and to build a new city hall, public markets, public schools, and other public spaces. In 1949, he was ambushed by Hook Balahap members in Nueva Ecija en route to Baler for the dedication of a hospital to the memory of the late President Manuel Quezon. The rebels fired upon the convoy, killing Ponciano Bernardo, former First Lady Doña Aurora Quezon, her daughter Baby Quezon, her son-in-law Philip Buencamino III, and eight others. Ponciano Bernardo was only 43 years old. His son, Ponciano Bernardo Jr., became a physician and a prominent urologist. His other relatives became entrenched in the local political ecosystem of Bulacan. Mamerto Carpio Bernardo became mayor of Balagtas. Matias Bernardo Ramirez became mayor of Bukawe. Jose Espina Bernardo became mayor of Pandi. And Benito Bernardo Cruz became mayor of Angat. Many of his distant blood relatives continue to be active in local politics today. A grade school and a high school were named after him for his contributions to Quezon City. Oh, 